Hello. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, sir. From Starlink Agency, right? Yes, ma'am. Right on time. What's that your name again? Nuna Chim, ma'am. Honey? Yeah? Of course, Muna Chim from Starlink Agency. Muna? Mm -hmm. This is my fiance. I adore and respect him so much. So I expect that you do the same. Sure, ma'am. And of course, I know you know why you're here. And I trust that you do a great job. <laughs> and the pay is mouth watery. If you don't have anything to worry about, ma'am, I take my job seriously. Of course you shouldn't. Honey, mm. do you know anything from Starlink Agency is perfect for me? Ah, uh, I'm sure. So, Muna, mm. I'll show you around. Sure. Follow sure. me. any hope for now. This is my last hope. I can do this job. When it comes to house choice, I can do anything at all. Name it. Any house choice, I can do it. I am very, very industrious. I need this job more than anything right now. I can make your home very neat. Just tell me anything, anything you want me to do, I will do it. Please help me secure this job. Help me keep it. Are you okay? The agency that sent you here is a trusted one. My wedding is in a few months. And my girlfriend specifically referred you. She says you have added knowledge in wedding planning and that you'll be of help. Yes, ma'am. That's why the pay is huge. My fiancé and I are always on business trips. So we need someone to always keep the house clean, warm, and in preparation for our wedding. So you're good to go. <sighs> I mean, I already accepted you before you came into my home. A few minutes ago, you met with my fiancé and introduction was done. And I brought you into this room myself. All this says you have the job already. I'm only here to see how you're faring. Yet you go with the word of suggestion that says you're not sure if you have the job already. Or you don't have the job already. I'm sorry, Ma. I... I... It's just that your fiancé hasn't said a word to me since I came. Perhaps he doesn't want my stay here. No, my darling, I think I'm the one to worry about that. Everything is fine, just relax. Just know your job here, do it diligently. And decency, the key word in this house. I'll see you around. I'll always remember that, right now. Take care.
I'm just going to sit here and watch Mama die due to lack of money to pay her hospital bill. God, it seems everything is turning against us. I've exhausted all the money I have on me. And everyone I keep calling keeps turning against me. No one keeps us doing this. So just stop. Stop. Stop it. <laughs> Mama is not going to die. All right? <laughs> Nothing will happen to Mama. <laughs> I will do anything. I will go any length. I will do whatever it takes. Even if it takes the last drop of my blood, I will do it. Mama must survive. All right? She's not going to die. Don't even say that. No. Just say that again. She is going to survive. Yes. Okay? She has to survive. She must. She must. She has to. <laughs> Mama will survive. I'm certain she will leave. Hello, big sis. How are you doing? You didn't call again as promised, though. Hmm. Big sis, I'm so excited to finally see my sister resuming work today. Hmm. With a salary that's worth dying for. Ah, big sis, tell me, how many government workers earn as much as 150,000 naira per month? <laughs> sis, you are so lucky. Like, 150,000 naira. Just for domestic chores. Ah, big sister, your boss must be very rich. Oh, <laughs> big sis, don't forget. Just in case they need an assistant worker, tell them you have a younger sister who is ready to work. Ah, yes, so at least I'll be contributing my own quota here, not just you now. Eh, big sis. Anyway, big sis, what am I coming over? And the address you didn't send it again. Hello? Big sis?
I I am leaving, sir. As difficult as this decision of mine is for me, I still have to leave. I can't stay in a home where I know that I'm not truly welcomed. I don't need the prophet to tell me that my presence here irritates you. Thank you for letting me stay at first. I really appreciate. But I need you to know this, sir. Not every girl you find on the street is a street girl. And not every girl you find at home is a decent girl. Wait. Go back inside and resume your duties. You're here to work. Yes, sir. And not to be on the streets. Try to put on some decency. Always make sure you're decently dressed. sure about this now? About what? Cheat with your best friend's woman who is supposed to be married to him in a few months. How comfortable are you with it? Come on, babe, you didn't just say that to me. You didn't just say that to me. The last time I checked, we are in this together. You wanted us as much as I do. She loved me. And I love you as well. Is it my fault that Alex believes that any girl who doesn't smoke or drink or go to club is a good wife material? Why the one that goes to club is not due for marriage? It's not my fault that he saw you in my house and started loving you. That's because you made him believe I'm your distant cousin. He trusted you. Distant cousin? What kind of distant cousin that comes to my house without another woman coming and says this long? Oh. What are you trying to say? Who says that um, close relatives can't visit each other? What I'm trying to say is that he trusted blindly. My first love left me way back because of Alex. Because he was the richer one. And now this is happening. What do you expect me to do? I had to play along. I had to play along. Since he wants to make you his wife before he can give you access to his wealth. Baby, you have to do this. You have to do this for us. 
just get married to him and get access to his world and we will leave this country. People will be happy together. You love me, right? Babe. Mm. Yes. I love you. Trust me. We're in this together. Girlfriend, Wola, what are you talking about? You feel so ashamed of yourself that the grand should open to swallow you up. Why? Come on, will you stop this your songs of lamentation and not allow you the, the, the mistakes of your part haunt you this way? Okay, okay, fine. I am not going to act insensitive about how you feel, but then don't allow your conscience to flog you this way. You know why? Because that is not whom you truly are. You're not a call girl, you're not a street girl. See, whatever you did or whatever you think you, were, you did then, you just did it because of your mother. Your mother was sick. And that was the only thing, the only option that came to your mind. You had to raise money for your, your, your mother's hospital bill. If I were you, mm, I will face my job, like my work, whatever the man say or think, it doesn't really count now. See, what matters most now is that you get paid well at the end of every month. The man is a wealthy man who doesn't want his woman to do anything in the house. You have what he wants, so give it to him. Grab your bag and face your front. Yes, face your front and forget your past. Don't let your past haunt you. You, you, see, you are allowing your past to haunt you. Yes. Oh. Okay. Hey, what's up, bro? <laughs> I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Oh, my woman, she's out of town. What are you envying me for, huh? <laughs> who is single and who is not single here? <laughs> I beg, get out, prostitute. <laughs>
You're back. I see you. I beg. I want to tell you something. What is it? Hi, and you look. You see that delicious meal where you give me? Yeah? That food too sweet, I bet. The food sweet. You know, this is where my mama and papa bought me. Yeah? I never chopped that kind of food. Not only for December time, we the chop and go village. Thank you. I'm happy you liked it. And you look. I don't just like them. I love them. Ha! But, and you look. Yeah? I beg. Next time, where you want to give me food? Hmm? Put them all here. Just put on like seven or more. I they like meat well, well. I they like meat. If you put on like seven or ten, I go manage them. Okay, I've heard you. I will always do that. Mm. Wait, is that our cake? Course. No, 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 no. These I, are just samples. I don't like this one. Can I see another one? Sure. Um, this is okay. Let's see the next one. Okay. How about this? No. Next. Yeah. Ooh. Wait, hold on. How about this? I kind of like this, but let's keep going. Of course, we have more options to choose no. from. Ooh. Ooh, this. Okay, hold on. Hold on, let me see. This. No, I like this one. I knew you were going to like it. Is that what you chose? Yes, baby. Are you serious? Yes. Mom, I will not. Thank you. Welcome. Wait, are you saying you chose that because I chose that? Um, because I know what you like. Because you know what I like. Because we were. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome, baby. So we chose to. Forever, baby. Forever. I'm just, you know, agreeing to it because... Because what? I mean, because... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> mm. It is really good. It is nice. Yeah, forever you that. Uh, uh, such a lady. Uh -huh. This girl. <laughs> this girl. <laughs> okay. I love you so much. No. I love you more. No, I love you more. I love you more, more. Okay. You give up. You win. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, uh, you know, I know how to take really good care of you and make you fresher. No. I don't want to be fresh. <laughs> I want to be ugly. Fresher is the word, baby. Ugly. <laughs> Okay, let's... Whose mouth is that? Yours, of course. Give me apple. Do you know what, Muna? I love my baby so much and I can't wait to be his forever. Okay, so what's the color of your day, first of all? Uh, pink and peach. Pink and peach. Yeah. Okay, let's see what you have. Here. Yeah. No, this is plain pink. Okay, here. Yeah. Do you have something else? Of course, we have options to choose from. Right there. This is the perfect color. Uh -huh. This is pink and peach with a little touch of black. Yes. So it goes because the pink and peach is more, you know, obvious on the cake. Okay, so, so I think this goes perfect. So this it is. <laughs> yeah. Do you know what? I, I feel like a married woman already. You should. I mean, why not? <laughs> yes. And then I am very certain that you're going to be there. You will not hesitate to be there. It's a celebration. So I will be there. Of course. And who knows? 
who knows amen exactly what i was amen saying. to that <laughs> amen <laughs> yes my darling and so what are we having for tina oh i want to make um on the pita leaf on the that's my favorite hand dog mm -hmm. i'm sure some of these dresses will be your size oh yes now see they will be my size even if they're not my size i will force them on myself Ah, you mm -hmm. will force them on yourself. Yes, now. <laughs> hey, these dresses are so fine. I'm going to like it. Sis, this woman must be a very rich woman. It doesn't even belong to the working day. And she's already dashing you clothes. You can say that again. She's actually nice. Ah. Hmm. Hey, big sis. How about your boss, the man? Tell me, I hope you're taking your instrumental lessons seriously. Yes, Bixis. Yes, yes, I am. You're but, sure? Yes, yes. But Bixis, it seems as if you don't like talking about your boss. <sighs> My boss is fine. Okay. He's good. He's just there. Okay. Just there? Man, listen. My boss is not even the type that stays around. He's more of a traveler. And Madame also told me that once he comes back from the street, they will be getting married straight up. Oh, that's lovely. That's lovely. Okay, um, add this to the money I gave you last week for your upkeep. Oh, Big Sis, you're such a darling. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Big Sis. Thank you. You're welcome. Aww. One more thing. Okay. I don't want you going around with all the small, small boys in the street. Oh. Ma, I'm serious. Because I will cut someone's head off. <laughs> Including yours. Big sis. Uh -huh. uh, you don't know your baby sis again. I do. I know you. I'm Big just saying. Trust me. Trust me. I trust you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and Big sis. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. Very soon the narrative will change. And everything will be fine. It will be okay. I will make mama proud. Wherever she is, she will be so proud of us. Don't worry. I hope so. Yeah. For real. <laughs> You are the girl from the other day, right? I've seen you a couple of times in my friend's place. What was the meaning of what you did a few minutes ago? What do you mean by that? Why did you smack my ass? Why? Don't those hands of yours have manners at all? Take a chill pill. Seeing a beauty like you, I lost my manners. And your ass is meant for smacking, don't you think so? I think you should get to know me. Don't you die. Don't you dare try such again. Oh, you think I'm one of those street girls you mess around with? Try it again and you will hate yourself. Hey. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Come on, let's keep are jogging. You, are you sure? Yeah, I'm fine. Let's keep jogging.
<laughs> it shock you. Make you not shock you. If you see what in my eye they see for this company, especially when my guy don't travel, your eye gonna do. <laughs> Are you cheating on me? Come on. Of course you know I'm cheating on you with your best friend, Alex. The one who believes I walk down the aisle with him. It's no news. Enough of the drama. Are you cheating on me with any other guy aside Alex? Excuse you. Wait, why would you say a thing like that? Who was the guy you were with last night? Come on, babe. I am trusting that you're not forgetting that we have a plan together. We have a plan here. You're not going to cheat on me, are you? I am not cheating on you and I'm never going to cheat on you. Okay? This is serious. How can a woman flirt with a man in her house just because he traveled? Are you sure about this? <laughs> this is ridiculous. Maybe there was no love in the first place. <laughs> Muna, <laughs> keeps and caring, you say. Wait, wait, are you loving your boss? Okay, okay, my win. I rest my case. <laughs> yes, so I rest my case. You win. Uh. Soma? Yes, and Sabia. Your sister said that her boss traveled and won't be back in a while. Yes, what happened? The other day she came to my house and we came out of the gate and we saw his car parked outside. He drove off as soon as he saw us. And same thing happened today again. Hey, Auntie Sandra, what are you saying in essence? I think the man is stalking your sister. 
stalk him, my sister. Why? That I do not know. Since the only option he gave is getting married to him before I can have access to his wealth, I'm fully ready to do whatever it takes as long as the end product is we having access to everything he owns. It's not my fault that I'm not in love with him. But you. Hey, babe. What are you saying, Smith? You're not interested in me anymore. Listen, go to hell, okay? Who cares? I learned you made your way. Yes, ma'am. It's just me gathering money now for school. But first, my jam. Ah, uh, uh, your big sis is there now. She will take care of it. Uh, yes. But, Auntie Sandra, eh? it seems as if my sister is trying to quit her job. Quit her job? Mm -hmm. Why do you say so? I don't really know. Just that these days it feels like. She's trying to tell me something, but then she just end up not saying anything. Um, um, uh, sweetheart, listen, okay? I, I, I don't know what that is, but I am very, very sure that it has nothing to do with her quitting her new job. Ah, ah, who quit such a much watching job in this her era again? Uh, <laughs> she's not quitting her job, okay? Mm. Uh, okay. Bye, now, Sandra. Let me get going. All right, bye-bye. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. bye yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>
listen, I, I'm running out of patience. I don't have time. I, I want to sell anything I can lay my hands on. Are you coming with me or not? Marry me. Why? What crime have I committed again that you just to set me up? Set you up? Yes. In a few weeks to come, you'll be taking your woman to the altar. And here you are asking another to marry you. Yes. I'll be walking down the aisle, but not with the woman you know. Yes, of course. That's because I do it better than that Mugu. In his mind, he thinks that you're staying after the marriage. Silly. Mm, and baby, honestly, I can't wait. I can't wait for him to return from his travel so that we'll get married. Since that's the only condition he gave to me before I can have full access to his wealth. Interesting and seriously, like I can't wait for that to happen too. You know what I mean? So that we can fly away. Ooh. Far away. Far, 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 far away. away. <laughs> you and I, baby. Come yes, right here. to take me as an option because your woman broke your heart? You want to marry someone that you don't know, not even dated? Six months is enough time to date. For months I've been dating you in my head. 
And I'm sure you do as well. How is it even possible that I'm dating you in my head? You do. It's written all over you. That's not possible. Look. I know where you're driving at. But you're not the same image you portrayed when we first met. How long will you keep tormenting yourself over mistakes of the past? Muno, for crying out loud, you were never a street girl. Whatever you tried doing then was to raise money for your mother's sickness, which never happened. Your boss might feel some type of way about you now because he felt you were a street girl. But trust me, someday he would see reasons to believe who you truly are. Maybe, just maybe you're right. That not every girl you find in the street is a street girl. And not every girl you find at home is decent. My man, you're here? I... 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 I, I, I thought you said you, you weren't coming back until next week. Only, I, I only... I just went to... To finish what you started. <sighs> Which assessment. Right? Come on, boy. It's not what you think, okay? It's not what you think. Um, maybe I will just, I'll just be on my way now. Just... You 
if 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 I if I if I if I nod you, eh? If I nod you, guys, if I bring my head back, bring and front, I will just condemn you. Hmm? Bro, I can explain the whole of this. Keep your explanations to yourself. I am sure the authorities will be interested in the case of theft, conspiracy, fraud, and impersonation. Good job, Johnny. Thank you, sir. It's been three days and you haven't lightened up your mood. You know, one would think this is something you can easily snap out of. Or you're in fully world that you've taken your decision even before your fiance left. I have a confession. As difficult as this might sound, I still have to say it. I had these strange feelings the moment he declined having sex with me and left the room. I wasn't too sure what that was all about, but deep down my heart, my instincts told me that it's a man and his principal at work. I've always wanted a man like you in my life. Life happened and we met again. It was the same picture of a man painted in my head. But then, the first narrative wouldn't paint a picture of love without obstacles. Sir, this is me telling you that I'm in love with you. I love you with everything in me. Life is beautiful when you find the right one. Love is so real when you find the right one, but it's so heartbreaking. Giving your own and be kept in the shadows. It's so heartbreaking. Being so true. To an existed lie, yeah. Look deep, you will see. Search deep, you will find. Someone loves you more. Loves you more. Look 
deep you will see, such deep you will find, the summer one loves you more. I'll give you my heart, my body and my soul, you threw it in the mud. Why did you treat me so? Why did you break my heart? You stabbed me behind my back. I thought I was loved. I thought I was cherished. I thought you meant everything you promised me. Oh, look deep, you will see. Such deep, you will find. The someone loves you more. Look deep, you will see. Such deep, you will find. The summer one loves you more. Look deep, you will see. Such deep, you will find. The summer one loves you more. Look deep, you will see. Such deep, you will find. The summer one loves you more. Wow. I had so much fun. Yes, I actually had so much fun. You know, we should do this again. Thank you for completing me. I should be the one thanking you. You know what they say? For anyone that crosses path with you, there is always a reason for that. Well, I am happy our path crossed. Me too. You're so beautiful. Thank you. And I have to do this again. We should. Well, let's see. Bonacci. I want to grow old with you. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. I want to cry with you. And I want to be happy with you forever. Please, will you marry me? Life is beautiful when you find the right one. Love yes. is so real. Oh, is it yes to start? <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, wait. So oh. I love you. And be kept in the shadows. It's so heartbreaking. <laughs> Being so true. Now do that. Yes, we're doing it. 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 We're doing Look deep, you will see. Such deep, you will find. The summer one loves you more. I give you my heart, my body, and my soul. In the mud. Why did you treat me so? Why did you break my heart? You stabbed me behind my back. I thought I was loved. I thought I was cherished. I thought you meant everything you promised me. Oh, look deep, you will see. Such deep, you will find the someone. Loves you more.